Hey everyone, so today I'm going to be doing an updated what's in my purse video and yes, this is actually the same purse that I used in my previous what's in my purse video but it just goes to show how much I love this bag and it's actually the biggest purse that I own um, well, that I use on a daily basis, so that is why there is so much junk in it. I have like little um, like crossbody bags or like small little clutches, but those don't really hold anything interesting. So since there is so much junk in my purse and I actually need to clean it out, I thought I would do a what's in my purse video while I'm cleaning it out. Um, so I... I kill two birds with one stone, but I'm not actually killing birds. So, um, like I said in my last video, this is a coach bag, and I actually got it on Boxing Day, what was it, two years ago, for half price. So, I really love this purse. It's black leather with gold hardware, and I get so much use out of it. It also has a shoulder strap, and then these are the straps that you can put on the crook of your arm. So I like wearing it both ways and I just use this purse all the time. So I'm going to go ahead and show you what's inside. Um, oh, I thought I'd point out that the inside lining is red, which is like a nice interesting touch to this purse. So I'm going to go ahead and jump into it. Honestly, there's so much junk in this purse. This is going to be pretty interesting. So the first thing that is pretty normal, I will pull out my wallet and this is actually my favorite wallet Ever because um, it has a little strap on it and you can just like take this and go if you're going somewhere like quickly or like you don't want to bring a whole purse this holds everything that I need and it actually has a oh a nickel fell out of it um, but it actually has like a little slot in the middle of it so that I can put my phone which is over there on my bed um, yeah it fits my phone perfectly in the middle so I can zip it up and take this on my way. It's so convenient. It's from Aldo, if you're wondering. So, um, the next thing in my purse is actually this little notebook, and this is from Target, and I just like to write things down all the time. Like, I'm the kind of person that I think a lot, so if I come up with, like, an idea for something, maybe, like, a, a video idea, or I just want to make, like, a to-do list, this is the perfect notebook for it. And I really like that the pages are perforated, so they're really easy to tear out, um, and you don't get, like, those, like, squiggly little lines from... The spine of the notebook so this is really convenient and it's a cute little pattern from Target it was probably a couple dollars so I really like to carry little notebooks around with me the next thing that I have in my purse is actually my calculator um, and this is in here because uh, what was it two weeks ago I had exams so we have the last day of our exam is exam return day where you can go in and check your marks so they let you look at your exam and so I like to calculate my mark um, to like make sure it's right and where it should be um, so I still have my calculator in my purse I should definitely take this out because I don't need it anymore this is why I'm cleaning out my purse the next thing that I have are icebreakers and these ones they're not necessarily my favorite. I like the sour ones better, but these are the dual ones. They're strawberry, so they're like cooling on one side and strawberry on the other side. Yeah, I don't know. I like to have like mints or stuff with me. Going along with that, I have two packs of gum. Not quite sure why I have two. I was probably like, I don't know, maybe I couldn't find this one in my purse, so I put in another one. This one's fuller. But anyways, two packs of gum both mint flavored. I have a Starbucks wrapper. So it's probably from banana bread because I always get Starbucks banana bread. It's so good. I have a pair of 3D glasses from when I watched Monsters University. <laughs> it was a really cute movie. I actually saw it twice. I love that movie. I'm like obsessed with Monsters Inc. so it's just appropriate that I saw it twice. Then I have a antibacterial hand gel from Bath and Body Works, and this is in front fresh lime basil. It smells really good. I like this one a lot. The next thing in here I have is actually the nail polish that I'm wearing on my nails right now, and this is the Nicole by OPI from the Selena Gomez collection in Stars at Night, and I have it over. Um, a pink nail polish. This is Off the Shoulder by Essie. So I just have this as like a sparkly top coat. It's like little line glitter, um, silver glitter. It's really cute. 
So I really like that nail polish and I just, I don't know, I don't know why it was in my purse, but I have that in there. I also have a MAC Dazzle, or yeah, Dazzle Glass in Moth to Flame lip gloss. Then I also have another lip product. You're going to see like 40 lip products in here. That's an exaggeration, but there's going to be a lot. Um, this is the Sugar Rose Tinted Lip Treatment from Sephora that they give you for your birthday probably what like a year ago and this is all like melted so yep but it smells really good then I have a soft lips lip gloss and what's the color here natural honesty then I have a pen to go along with my notebook that one's from a dance competition that I went to I have another pen should probably oh here's the lid I have a perfume sample and this one is from I think it's from Aerie. I have house keys. Those are usually kept in my wallet. I have my Baby Lips lip balm. This is my favorite lip balm. It's like almost done. Do you guys finish lip balms? Because I feel like I always lose them before I actually finish them. But surprisingly, I've kept track of that one. Then I have my favorite uh, Revlon lip butter in strawberry shortcake. Um, I think that's it for lip products, so I won't be pulling out any more. Then I have a little mirror, um, and this is from Originals, which is the dress boutique that I got my prom dress at. They gave me this little mirror to keep in my clutch at prom, so it just ended up in this purse. Then, <laughs> you're gonna laugh. Then I have, like, how many do I have? Six wet nap, or wait, what are these called? Like, the little napkin things? from Wild Wings, um, yeah, it's like the chicken wing place. My friend told me to take them, so I did. <laughs> I have a movie ticket from Olympus Has Fallen. Don't even remember seeing that movie. Oh, more movie tickets. I have G.I. Joe 3D. I have a little hair clip. Then inside the zipper pocket here. I have Advil and a bunch of tampons. Oh, and a hair tie. Oh, and bobby pins and an earring I lost. Huh. Didn't even know that was in there. Like I lost one of them, so I took off that one and put it back in here. Um, and then I just have a bunch of change and bobby pins at the bottom of my bag. So, that is all the crap that was in my bag. I hope you guys all enjoyed watching. And now I have to sort through this, throw most of it in the garbage. And that's about it. So I hope you guys all enjoyed, and I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye! Oh, now I gotta put everything back in my bars. Is it hot in here, or is it just me? Oh, look at this. Let's take a little tour. Look at all the junk that was in my purse. We're all in this together. We're all stuck and we see you. I'm tired, by the way. Don't judge me. Uh. <laughs>